What the heck is going on guys? It is your boy Henry Rex. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing another G Fuel review. Uh, today it's actually a flavor that I've already had. Um, in fact, a lot of. This is the G Fuel Sour Cherry Tub. Uh, information facts right there. So I've already had this flavor to the extent that I've actually finished my entire tub. This was... Oh, I keep my some of my shakers or my scoopers in there this was my second ever g fuel tub that i got the first was pewdiepie um yeah, as soon as it came out i copped the pewdiepie this was the second ever they had a bogo like right after so i copped this and um cotton candy which are two of my favorites even up until this day so yeah in case you guys don't, can't tell i love the sour flavors i have a huge bias towards the sour flavors but I thought it would be kind of interesting to do the review of the Sour Cherry, since it is one of my favorites. We are going to be using the PewDiePie, speaking of PewDiePie, the PewDiePie Collector's Box Shaker Cup. And oh yeah, before I crack this open, I should probably show you what this looks like. This is the reason why we are able to do a review, because of we have a single packet. I ordered this when I ordered my Moon Pie uh, collector's box. If you guys haven't seen that video, the video should be posted. Um, the Moon Pie G Fuel collector's box video. It's one I highly recommend before you purchase the G Fuel Moon Pie. If you're thinking about purchasing it, you should watch the video first. Um, but yeah, I also got some of these single packs because I wanted to make a sour cherry review, but I didn't have the funds to just go out and cop a whole nother uh, tub of it right away. So anyway, the powder in this, in tubs, you guys, whoa, I got breathed some in by accident. I think I vaped some sour cherry by accident just there. You guys know in tubs, powder is generally just a white color, except for the moon pie. In packets, they usually re the color resembles the actual flavor itself. Here it's got a reddish tint. Right, let's put our ice in. Put our water in. Oh yeah, we gotta make sure we're getting our 12 ounces. And yes, I know I'm spilling. That's why we got the, the towels down though. A little more. That should be good. And yes, I'm using a salsa container for water. They make good drinking cups. Plus they're, um, you know, it's kind of like recycling. And anyway, let's put this... Uh, top in get shaken then I'll let you know I haven't had this flavor for so long boys like this is my favorite flavor I would say even still um yeah and my and my tub's been gone for so long I haven't been able to have any for a long time and I've been craving the flavor so I'm glad I got like three single packs of this so anyway here is what it looks like it looks like cherry, like if you got some cherry juice or something like that. Yeah, it looks exactly like cherry. The smell. You've got the, you've got the sour. The sour is very prominent in this flavor. That's the first thing I smell. Then I get a cherry aftertaste. It's a very, very strong flavor. In case you guys have not had this flavor. Even just based off the smell, it's strong. So now let's go for the taste. Whoa. Yeah, um, been a while since I had this flavor. I'm a sour fan. And you get the sour right off the bat. Yeah, you get the sour cherry there too. It's that kind of sour that almost makes you like squint your eyes or pucker your lips and it's one of the more sour flavors too like sour um sour grape which we did on the channel go check out that video by the way sour grape not as sour as the sour cherry um i don't know if we've done any other sour sour um reviews on the channel i know i've tasted sour chug rug i have not done a video on that yet but sour chug rug is i would say not as sour as this um, I haven't tasted sour phase berry yet, but out of the sour flavors I have tasted, this would be the sourest by far. Yep, 
it's got a very very accurate sour cherry we actually have a sour cherry tree in our yard and um it's almost exactly like this to be honest a lot of people are saying it's too sour i would say maybe it's too sour if you're not a sour fan but i, I only add 12 ounces of water and even then it's not too sour it's pretty sour don't get me wrong but i wouldn't say it's too sour but yeah anyways um without yeah too much more ado i think it's time to give it a star ranking so out of uh 10 stars i would definitely give this flavor a 10 out of 10. it's definitely not just a pure ch uh, cherry flavor it's definitely a sour flavor uh, sour cherry flavor and it's exactly what the tub says sour cherry um if you're a sour fan you'll definitely like it if you're a cherry fan you'll definitely like it and um yeah that's exactly why i'm giving it 10 out of 10. thanks for watching hopefully you guys did enjoy the video like the video to get more uh g fuel reviews uh i'll see you again soon i post every monday and friday